Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to make a basic Nendoroid diorama. This can be used for your toy photography or a cute way to display your figures or toys. So you will need four pieces of foam board, four pieces of scrapbook paper, two dollhouse windows, an X-Acto knife, glue, adhesive, measuring tape, a ruler, and the toy of your choice. Start by cutting two pieces of foam board, six inches by six inches, and the other two, six inches by eight inches. Next, we're gonna figure out where the windows will go. Make sure the windows are not too low or too high, otherwise it will look a little weird next to your Android. Trace around your window and measure the distance of your window to the bottom to match with your other window. You don't have to use two windows either, one of them is just fine, and the windows I'm using are from Hobby Lobby that I painted white, but you can also check eBay, Amazon, or AliExpress for cheap windows, or you can have no windows, whatever you prefer. Using a metal ruler and X-Acto knife, carefully cut out the outlines for the windows. It's okay if it's a little messy since it will be covered up by our window anyway. Now we're going to glue our scrapbook paper to the foam board. When picking out your scrapbook paper, you want to choose two kinds, one for your flooring and the other for your walls. I bought my scrapbook paper from Amazon, but craft stores tend to have larger selections of paper. Again, using your X-Acto knife, we're going to carefully cut out the extra paper and pop the windows into their spot.
Using our adhesive or double-sided tape, we're going to assemble our diorama. I decided to go with adhesive so that the diorama is able to be taken apart easily for easy storage. I can also make different designs of walls and floors to mix around for a different look. Let me know if you'd like to see any other designs by leaving a comment down below. And here is our finished diorama. Let's add some life to it by furnishing it with some remit pieces and calico curtain furniture. I hope you enjoyed my basic Nentoroi diorama. I've been working hard to find the perfect size and method to make this and I'm really proud of what I've come up with. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!